Hey everyone, Zach from Deploy Football here. In this short clip, I'm gonna show you how to pump up the ball correctly and ensure that it's at the right pressure. One of the biggest factors that can affect your game is using a football with incorrect air pressure. So whether it's too hard or too soft, both impact the performance of the football. Before going for a kick, start training or playing a game, make sure you check the pressure with a pressure gauge. When inserting the gauge or pump needle, always make sure the needle is wet. Ensure that the needle enters the valve straight Otherwise, you could puncture the bladder or damage the valve. Check the pressure reading on the gauge and compare it to the recommended PSI or bar measurement on the football. If it is too high, let some of the air out using the pressure release valve on your gauge or a disconnected needle. If it's too soft, insert the pump and inflate the ball. Make sure to check the pressure afterwards. In the deploy range, the T-Spec Series 3 should be kept between 7 to 8 PSI. With the intent, engage, stealth, ignite, and envision should all be at 10.5 PSI. This will ensure optimum performance when using any of the deploy football range. When inflating a brand new football, there is one extra step to take to make sure your new deploy football will be in perfect condition. Inflate the ball to six to seven PSI and give it a few bounces and let it sit for a minute. This ensures the bladder and the internal layers expand and form the correct shape. This step is especially important if you are using a compressor to inflate the football, as they generally pump a lot of air quickly into the football. Also, another tip, don't stress too much if you notice your football needs a top up every now and then, as it is perfectly normal for the football to lose pressure over time. This is more common in the higher end footballs, such as the Ignite and the Envision, due to the materials used. Always keep a pump handy. If you don't have a pressure gauge, the best method is to gradually pump and fill the bore as you inflate it. It should feel firm, but not too hard. Always give it a kick test to be sure. The most important thing to remember is not to overinflate your ball. This can cause injuries to players and also damage your new Deploy Football. Make sure to like and subscribe below, follow Deploy Football on Facebook and Instagram for more informative content, and don't forget to head to deployfootball.com to purchase any of the new Deploy Football range.